a cruel assumption. A cruel assumption is basically one of another fundamental accounting assumption which is used for the purpose of preparation of financial statements. Okay, there are basically two events that normally happen in any kind of a purchase or sale transaction or an expense or an income transaction. Let's say expense and let's take the example of income. So let us say there are two dates. One is let's say February 2012, 2nd February 2012 and the other one is let's say 30th April 2012. When we talk about an expense, let's take an example. Let's say you purchase computer. So let us say we purchase computer on 2nd February 2012 and we paid the vendor on 30th April 2012. Similarly, let's say for example, we sold goods on 2nd February and we received payment on 30th April. Okay, so if you notice in both these cases there are two distinct events. One is the actual transaction date, the date when the transaction actually happened whether it was selling of goods or purchasing of computer. And the second is the payment or the settlement date as we call it. The date when the settlement of this particular transaction on the left side happened. Right? According to the accrual assumption, okay, what happens is that we record transactions And transaction can be your expense, income, as they take place instead of the date of settlement. So what happens in both these cases, insofar as my accounting is concerned, I accrue, accrue means to incur. I accrue the expense on the date when it is taking place, as against the date when I make the payment. So in both these cases, what I will do is that on 2nd February 2012, I will book an expense, I will book an income, okay? This is also known as accrual system of accounting, okay? Whereas in cases where you record a transaction on date of payment, that is known as cash basis of accounting. Cash basis is far too few, okay, and normally Accrual basis is what is important. Let's say for companies, okay, in India, accrual basis of accounting is mandatory. You can't follow cash basis of accounting. In some forms of business organization, this is also followed, but accrual is the order of the day. And this is important because that recording itself enables you to compare what kind of an expense you have incurred against the income you have earned. Right? 